Hello everyone. Today I'm checking a new lens, teleconverter, zoom lens. I'm not sure who is the manufacturer. It say here professional HD DSLR uh, telephoto lens, Japan Optics. It is 3.5x zoom. Uh, this one I bought for 22 US dollars. Uh, you can get the 2x zoom for half the price, around uh, 10 US dollars. It's quite big optics, big glass here. The good thing in this, uh, it can fit in the thread in front of the lens, the uh, thread for filters. So I bought the thread size for my Camlan prime lens. The thread for Camlan is 52 millimeter. So you just fit as if it was a filter. Just screw the thread. Then you get the zoom lens uh, additional to the uh, prime lens. This is 3.5x additional to the 28, so it will be more than 100 millimeter focal length. And this is micro four thirds, so it will be equivalent to around 200 something in a full frame camera. So it's quite a zoom. Uh, I'll be doing the test and uh, I'll be sharing the raw footage and videos, so stay tuned. So it comes with soft pleather pouch. It's uh, all metal and glass. Uh, it's quite bulky and heavy. It has two plastic caps. The main problem with teleconverter uh, lens uh, is fixed on short lens below uh, 35 or 40. They will show vignetting as you can see here which is the black uh, circle. Panasonic has an option called teleconverter on so it crops using software to the center so it remove the uh, vignetting circle. Here we can see sample with the prime lens. Uh, then we can see teleconverter zoom lens. Once we close the aperture ring, we can see the vignetting getting darker. We can see the black ring become darker. Now we'll uh, close down to 5.6 f 5.6. Now we crop to the uh, sensor center using teleconverter on option in the camera. So it crop digitally, uh, it zooms digitally to the center of the sensor. We can see the image is a bit soft and we, ha we have a color fringing on the edges. Uh, going back to the prime lens to compare, we can see it's uh, it can zoom uh, quite far here a colorful uh, video with a prime lens we zoom in with the teleconverter and the crop uh, digital zoom also so back and forth we can see a huge difference in zoom between the prime lens and the teleconverter zoom lens so this lens is useful for video since we cannot zoom that far using the digital crop in the sensor. We can see the sharpness here comparing with and without lens uh, when zooming on text. Also we can see the shift in color, the color fringing. This is the prime lens. Now we zoom in using the teleconverter uh, zoom on option in the camera. And now we use the teleconverter zoom lens. We can see the color fringing around the edges of the letters. But the sharpness is still okay, is acceptable. So for video is kind of useful. 
For pictures, this is a picture uh, taken in quite dark conditions. I took with the prime lens and with the teleconverter, then cropped in using same settings. We can see here for pictures, it doesn't give you any uh, new information, but for video, I can see the benefit. It can zoom quite well beyond the uh, allowed cropping, digital zooming in video mode. Okay, thank you for watching.